Hey Sparkers, we are doing another video today. This one is going to be on the tone presets. So uh, this is a fairly new feature released uh, maybe two weeks ago, a week and a half ago, something like that. Uh, pretty cool feature. So the way it works is when you look for a song um, from YouTube, uh, basically there's a, a way to have a pre-selected tone there um, so kind of an easy button, if you will, right? If you don't want to look for a, a particular tone for a particular song, uh, the user community is going to be there for you to have uploaded one uh, before and associating uh, a tone with a song. Uh, so we're going to show that feature today. Uh, I'm going to show you how to use it, how to find it. Um, I'm going to show you how to select a tone, uh, one of yours perhaps, uh, for others to use. So. Another thing I want to make a quick announcement. So I'm changing up the the way I do these videos a little bit, um, trying to do something new. So I'm adding a video of myself. Um, so you're going to see me in the corner of this video. And I'm also recording, um, interacting with my iPad uh, just from the iPad itself. So I don't have video of me tapping on the iPad. So this will be a little different. We'll see how it goes. It's kind of an experiment. Um, let me know what you think. Um, open to feedback as always. I appreciate everyone's comments and, and thoughts. So let's go ahead and jump right in. So first is to use this, uh, you know, you look for a song, right? So let's look for one. Uh, we'll just do basket case. That one already has some. I saw that earlier. So uh, normally this is what you have. I'm going to pause that. So you, you normally see the chords on the bottom, right? You'll see the, the tabs and the chords. Uh, but you'll notice now right below... Um, Right below the video but above the chords and tones it says tones right there so you tap that guy and down below here will be a list of of preset tones that people have shared so you'll find um, that people have shared tones and the nice thing is you can there can be multiple right so a given song can have two three four probably who knows how many uh, and people will just say you know people will like one better than another uh, for a particular song and some may work better with one guitar versus another so it's kind of nice to have multiple so well and you this works just like the tone cloud right so you can download it you can uh, play you can preview it um, and you can sh also share it uh, so uh, if I wanted to just sort of test that out right now I'll, I'll let's do this I'll just pr press the little play button there let's try this out okay not bad Let's try this one out down here. Okay, a little louder, uh, but uh, cool. So I'm gonna, I'm also gonna show you how to add your own. So I'm going to share, uh, and there's two options when you're when you're adding one, right? There's share current preset, and then there's share your tone cloud preset. So if you do share current preset, that's gonna whatever tone you have currently selected, uh, it'll it'll upload that and you can, uh, and I'll sh I'm not going to do that here, but I'll, I'll show that a little bit later. Um, but you can also share your tone cloud preset. So, uh, you know, you would go find your version of this song. I'll go ahead and do that here now. I think I have one for this. Yeah, there we go. So I'll go ahead and share that. And now um, that is going to be at the bottom of this list here somewhere, or maybe at the top. Uh, I guess I got the highest number of downloads, so it prioritized mine at the top there. So that's, that's how you uh, um, share one of your existing tone clouds. Uh, now, if you already have your tone selected, let's say you just made one. So I'll pretend I just made this one, I, I, although I made it before. This is my uh, Bush come down tone. So if I wanted to upload this tone that I just finished working on, I would, you know, I would go in and I would find that, that song. So let's do come down. There it is. And we'll just play this first one, and so you can see there's no, uh, there's no uh, tones shared yet. So we'll go ahead and share preset, and I'll share current preset since I already have it selected. And you can use this to actually change the name of it, add tags, that sort of thing. This may not actually work actually because I think I already have this tone uploaded, but let's just try it. I'm going to do, yeah, it's the no, that's not the right. Bridge pickup. Here we go. Let's do a couple more. Strat. Uh, let's do Bush. I like using a lot of tags, obviously. And so, yeah, that looks good. 
let's go ahead and do share. Yeah, it's already existed. And that's just because I already have this, this tone that I've shared to the tone cloud. Uh, but if you hadn't shared that tone already, you would be able to do that. So I'm just going to do this instead. Um, and oops, let's do, I did that wrong. Here we go. Oop, not that one. Where is this guy? There it is. So I'll do share and there we go. So that's how you would share one of your existing uh, tone cloud um, tones or someone else's. I, uh, you can't, well, yeah, you can't actually share someone else's. You have to only, you can only share your own and I've, that's for, you know, pretty good reason. Uh, but if I were using someone else's preset right now, I could share that one. So that's how presets work. It's a pretty cool feature. Like I said, kind of an easy button. A lot of people were asking about, you know, how do I just, you know, if I start playing a song uh, from YouTube or whatever, how do I get that tone kind of automatically? A little bit of a you know, shortcut, easy button. So it's a nice feature to have uh, and hopefully helps a lot of people out. Uh, a couple of my tones have been used for this. Uh, I think my Weezer buddy Holly tone is up there. I, I just did a couple here. Um, I think my my Blink-182 Dammit tone is up there, a couple others, but uh, it's a neat, neat feature. Uh, so check out some of your favorite songs. Look for that preset uh, tone and hopefully it's there. If it's not, make one. You know, put one up there, let other people use it. Uh, so... Yeah, hopefully you, you get uh, a chance to use this feature. It's a cool one, and hope this helps. See you guys.